Okay, we're back in the Elder Scrolls again. Now, the videos have been a bit slow of recent. Been uh, a lot of stuff to do lately. You know, life stuff. That stuff that always gets in the way. But, um, like I say, we'll um, keep knocking out these Elder Scroll ones and we will pop in tomorrow in from time to time. At the moment, I'm just waiting to see if they bring some patches and that. I mean, it's as you saw there's textures flickering and all sorts so I don't know if that's um, something they're gonna fix or maybe I need to fiddle around with the settings but for the moment I'll leave the settings until they've actually released the game fully and um, they might have a day one patch or something that may sort that so but anyway we're gonna go into the harbour and speak to uh, what's his face can't remember his name now oh yeah and you can see we got a sweet bit of armour on that we picked up it's all kind of green and stuff. This is it, the Prophet. That's who we've got to speak to. We have an unexpected guest, Estridge. What's Tharn doing here? My attempts to use the orb of discourse to locate Sai Sahan did not meet with success, so I decided to try a more direct approach. I used it as it was intended and contacted Abner Tharn. Is he being cooperative? He admits that he knows Sai Sahan's location, but he will not reveal it. He demands to speak with you directly. Let's hear what he has to say. We meet again, Vestige. I wish to speak with you on a matter of some urgency. What's this about? Menimarco and his vile master have dark and terrible plans for this world. If you wish to stop them, you need to find the Amulet of Kings. But to find the Amulet, you must first locate Sai Sahan. And you know where he is? Of course I do. And I might be willing to share that information. For a price. I'm listening. If Manny Marco learns that we've spoken, he'll have me executed. I'm a danger to him. I know too much. Therefore I, Abner Thahn, Chancellor of the Elder Council, Overlord of Nibane, formally request asylum. Asylum? Are you joking? Do I look to be in a mirthful mood? There comes a point when even a Patriot's loyalty is stretched too far, when the things he has done, and has seen done, become too much to bear. Will you come to us? Would that I could. As it happens, I find myself to be somewhat of a prisoner, in dire need of rescue. My proposal is this. If you retrieve me from Menemarko's fortress and grant me asylum, I will give you Sai Sahan's location in return. And how can I be sure this isn't a trick? You can't. And you'd be a fool to trust me completely. But the facts remain, you need me if you wish to find Sai Sahan, and I must keep my head if I am to ensure the continuance of the Empire. Neither of us has a choice. Mm. Let's see your point. Tharn is quite correct. We have little choice of the matter. You can't be serious. How can we possibly trust him? As our visitor so eloquently pointed out, we cannot. But if we are to locate Sai Sahan, we must do this. Go with the vestige, Lyris. Rescue Tharn. Give him the chance to redeem himself. He may surprise you. You appear to have arrived in the wretched squalor, a shantytown of soul shriven outside Menemarko's castle. How do we get inside? As luck would have it, Menemarko is away on some errand for the Daedric Prince. The castle garrison is not on alert, so you should only encounter a token defense. The main gate is sealed, but there are undoubtedly other routes one might take. Such as? You're the hero, aren't you? Improvise. We'll find a way in. Improvise, he says. A 
can't believe we're risking our lives to rescue that skeeving horker. Any suggestions? Subtlety and stealth. Let's not bring the entire castle guard down on our heads. And didn't he say this was a town of soul shriven? Maybe we can find one who knows his way around. We better get started then. From me. I don't have anything for you. Relax. I just wanted to weigh into the castle. Go away. Uh, call the guards. They'll... They'll... They'll probably take me too. Just go! Leave me alone! Buy something? Bamazar has rocks and dirt and bones. It is hard to be a merchant in the wretched squalor. I need a way into the castle, you know one? Feed first. That is the fastest way in. Ask Cadwell. That crazy bastard seems to know every corner of this place. Better hurry though. I heard they just chased him into a building near the waterway. Why am I not surprised to find Cadwell here? He certainly does get around. Yeah, and he's totally off his trolley. Where is he? He's down there. Looks a little bit unfriendly, doesn't it?
recipe for pumpkin cheesecake. I love cheesecake. I don't know about pumpkin, but I love cheesecake. I say, jolly good timing. Lyris enchanted, as always. And you, you're looking fit for someone, so uh, how can I put it? Deficient in the soul department? Sir Cadwell, what are you doing here? Wherever the forces of evil prey upon the innocent, wherever souls are stolen and bodies shriven, wherever a people cry out for justice, there goest I. I mean, this whole eternal servitude business is rather nasty, don't you agree? We need to find a way into the castle. You fellas got us. Why? Lovely grounds, no question, but it's positively brimming with angry cultists carrying rather large weapons. We need to rescue Abnathan. It's complicated. I see, I see. A rescue, is it? Well, that's a different kettle of fish, isn't it? Hmm. There is a cistern that drains into the waterway. Uh, the door is locked, but that's not stopped me before. Why don't you meet me there and we'll see what's what? Thank you, Sir Cadwell. That might be our best chance to get inside. The cistern. So in other words, another sewage kind of thing. Or maybe not so sewage -y. Picks. No one's going. Right, where are we going? All the way up there. Which is that way. Let me just check something out. Keep up nicely. I can't abide dawdlers. What's next? This whole bloody castle sits on top of an ocean of unstable oblivion, what's it? The Daedra use pipes to control the flow of it all, and it comes out as steam. Go on. Well, most of the doors in here are sealed with pressure from that steam. It's all rather complicated, but in a nutshell, if I can tamper with the pipes, we can open the doors to the inner keep, and you can slip inside. What do you need from us? Well, I could handle the tinkering, but you'll have to keep the beasties off me. It will be quite a romp. Are you game? Oh, I'm game. Let's go. Onward! Ha-ha! <laughs>
Ooh, there's a big guy. Ow. This will get you inside with a minimum of fuss. this one. There you are. Quick as you please. There's even time for tea. <laughs> Thanks. A pleasure thinking nothing of it. The merest trifle, truly. You'll find this Tharn fellow at the top of the Tower of Bones. You'll need to make your way through the Keep's heart to get to it, but it's not terribly far. What is he doing up there? I understand the King of Worms has set him to the task of inspecting the soul gems that find their way into the castle. Which is to say, well, uh, all of them. You'll see crates of the things scattered around the premises. Why don't you come with us? We could use another hand. Indeed? Well, I might just take you up on that. But safety first. I'll stay here for the nonce and make sure nothing comes to bugger up our little adventure from behind. Thanks again, Cadwell. Let's so go. Cadwell came through again. That crazy night is starting to grow on me. Should I be worried? Yeah, I would be. Fire. Would you shut up? I'm trying to work here. None. The one on the throne is a patsy, and the one in the tower isn't useful anymore. That's not even funny. Get back to work, would you? What? It's true. Lord Manamarco is going to peel his skin off and make a particularly ugly flesh atronach out of him. Mark my words. And if you don't help me, I'll make sure you're sewn up right alongside him. Now shut up! Don't mind me, just going through all your boxes.
You, hurry up. The worms are on the move. Taking this the right way. Yep. Oh, good. Another projection of Thorn. Maybe if we ignore him, he'll go away. There you are. I was beginning to think you were captured. We've a bit of a problem, I'm afraid. And what's this problem? The door at the top of the tower has sealed with a warded barrier. I've seen the worms use similar sorceries before. It will sear you to ash if you touch it. How do we get through it? Here's a thought. The flesh atronachs that patrol the castle halls are assembled in a laboratory very close to the warded door. If you created your own atronach, it would be bound to obey you. You could force it to smash through the barrier. But how do you build a flesh astronaut? It's a simple process. A child of five could do it. Unfortunately, we don't have a child of five, so I'll be forced to walk you through it. You'll need some good-sized chunks of flesh. Take them to the laboratory, and I'll contact you there. We're on our way. There's a full army in there. Oh look, shield flesh. Oh, I'm not going near the city butcher for a while, I'll tell you that much. Suppose we can have to kill that one. Recipe for melon jelly. Let me just. Uh... Oh, I already know it. By the looks of it. And okay, I can't do that until I have a little bit more experience. Right. Else around here? Oh, nope. Uh, what's he getting there? Better check this side. That'd be good. That means the body parts won't smell as bad.
those. Take it, that's the gate we gotta go up to there, so. Oh, big guy. Big guy. Those will take. I okay. can't imagine how the worms get used to this. Blueprint. There you go. Just see if we can use it. Yay. Old hutch, whatever that is. When we get around to doing some crafting, we still haven't got around to that yet. So much for this game, it uh, <coughs> takes a long time. Right. Can I go through here? Oh, I can go through here. Take it. City will take it. Take that, take that. You would think with all these soul gems around here that we'd get some soul gems. Oh. So 
got to go this way. Let me just check in here first. Slave's Diary. the ritual from the book. Ha! We'll make a necromancer of you yet. Okay, do do your thing. There's bound to be some, some surprises like that. So if it's an ingredient, ingredient, okay. Hold on. Look around for any secret goodies. Ash, yeah. Not quite what I had in mind. On insufferable worms. I'm working as fast as I can.
So, we meet in person at long last. You look taller in your projection. I'm here to get you out, per our arrangement. And not a moment too soon. If I had to inspect one more bloody soul gem, I'd have thrown myself from the tower. Why should we trust you then? A fair question. I know things. Things that can help you. Here's a bit to whet your appetite. Menemarco isn't doing any of this to serve Molag Bar. His ultimate plan is to out-scheme the God of Schemes and to replace him. What? How? The Amulet of Kings is the key to everything. Why do you think he kidnapped Sai Sahan? He's torturing him, trying to get him to reveal the amulet's hiding place. He's trying to find the Amulet of Kings before we do? Precisely. With the amulet at his command, Manny Marco believes he can trap Molag Baal's essence and absorb his power. He seeks to become a god himself. That sounds bad. What else can we tell me? I'd love to discuss this further, but this is hardly the place. Get me to a safe haven and I will tell you the rest. That was our agreement, was it not? Now, let's... Wait. Did you feel that? Feel what? Uh-oh. Wow. What the hell just happened? Fortunately, I have no soul. Stand back. So, quite what up? I think I'm supposed to get out the circle, maybe. So, we meet in person at long last. Nope. So, and not a fair coin. The amulet, precise. I'd love to. What? This doesn't make much sense. What's killing me? So do we stay where he is, maybe? Maybe if I don't touch that outer ring. He's not fine, so. So, we meet him. Now, now, Tharp. That's it. No telling my secrets. Go to your room, Abner. I will deal with you shortly. Ah, dear Lyris. Your old position at the foundry is still available. We'll even give you your own set of unbreakable chains. And you, the thorn in my side, the pebble in my shoe. How strong are you? Shall we test your units? Process drains the energy from most victims that you keep fighting. surprises me but how much more can you take I wonder a lot more is that all you've got
attack the Chancellor of the Elder Council. His power wanes, Vestige. Strike him down, while his attentions are on me. How dare you betray me, Zahn! Suffering will be legendary. He will not remain discorporated for long. His consciousness will be adrift for a few moments, but that is all. Why did you help me? Because Marimarco has delusions of godhood. He cares nothing for the Empire. He seeks only power. I've never done battle with him before. He's far more powerful than I imagined. Oh well, too late for regrets. In for a bean, in for a beanstalk. What now? First things first. We need to get out of here alive. What do you suggest? We certainly can't go back the way you came in. I'd imagine they're swarming the grounds already. There's a refuse chute further down the path. It's a bit of a drop, but we'll probably survive. Okay, into the bins we go. Uh, is it this way? Yeah. You must be the ugliest princess ever rescued from a tower, Tharn. Hmm. I'm shocked your lack of education and repeated blows to the head haven't dulled your wit, Titanborn. Hello again! Need a way out? Yes, certainly do. I'll have that open in just a moment. Preservers, you're as battered and bruised as a peach in a sack of rocks. Bit of the old daring do, was it? No matter. You'll be needing an escape route, no doubt. Great timing, Cadwell. Well, it's what I do, quite honestly. We should probably hurry it up. The entire castle is as bristly as a sack of sewing needles after all that noise. Why don't you come with us? Come with you? You mean leave Cold Harbor? Well, I, I don't know. It's been a very long time since I've seen the world I left behind. Do you think it's wise? You should come along, it might be good for you. Well, that's, uh, that's settled then. And after all, you do need someone to lead you out of here. Onward! Let's go. Into the chute, come on! Quickly! I've opened another portal. Hurry! Come on, people, let's go. My estates, my titles, my own life, it's all forfeit now. All in the name of preserving the Empire. I swear by all the gods, Menemarka will pay dearly for this. Are you right? Of course. I am Abnathan. It will take more than a few brainless cultists to rattle these old bones. Now then, where were we? You were going to tell us where Sai Sahan is. Ah, yes. <clears throat> Truth be told, I don't know the precise location, but I do know that he is Menemarko's prisoner, and that the King of Worms is trying to pry the location of the amulet from him. You don't know where he is. Now, now, before you lose your temper, let me clarify. I don't know precisely where he is, but I can find out. I'll just need a little time. So you tricked us, then. What? You son of a bitch! Ha! Ah! <laughs> Are you insane? Get away from me, you brutish she-troll! Yes, stand down. He's done nothing but lie to us from the beginning. I don't care what he says. He'll always be Menemarco's toady. Please! Manny Marco wants me dead. Did I pretend to capitulate to him? Yes, I did. Do you have any idea how many lives I saved by doing so? The only thing you saved was your holdings in your own hide, you pompous ass! Enough! Abner had no choice, Levis. And we are guilty of our own deceit, are we not? 
The time has come for the Vestige to know the truth. What's this? The Vestige doesn't know? Oh, this is rich. Sire, don't. Vestige, until now, you've only known me as the Prophet. But that is not my true name. I am Varen Aquilarius. Our fallen Emperor, in the tattered robes of a moth priest, blind as a newborn kitten. I am sorry I deceived you, Vestige. You are angry. It is to be expected. You're the Emperor? I was once, but no more. My name is Baron Aquilarius. Why didn't you tell me? Why the deception? In truth, I feared you'd kill me where I stood if you knew who I was. You certainly wouldn't have allied with us so readily. I caused this, all of this. If Melog Ball destroys this world, the blame will be mine and mine alone. How can I trust you now, or Lyris? You must not blame Lyris. She did as I instructed. She's my sworn protector. But she is also your ally. You have my solemn promise, Vestige. When this is over, if you still judge me harshly, you can end my life. I will offer no resistance. So what now? We must find Sysa Han. Everything depends on that. What should I do? In this matter, nothing. Abner and I must confer. We will contact you again when we have more information. I did not foresee Abner's defection, but I welcome it. Manamako fears him, and with good reason. He can help us. I feel certain of it. Okay, then. And we gained a skill point. And soul magic increase. Don't know what that is, but I'll take it. And an achievement. Castle of the Worm. Nothing else? Nope. 